Established in 2008, Epangelo Mining is a state-owned enterprise responsible for exploring and mining natural resources on behalf of the government. Initially, the company held 40 exclusive prospecting licenses, but the number has since decreased to 10. During a mining and energy workshop in Swakopmund, CEO Elifas Hawala informed attending parliamentarians that acquiring EPLs has become challenging. Consequently, the company is required to purchase these licenses on the market like any other interested party. With Flavor Uranium, that was an EPL that was owned by somebody else. We went in to get 10% on behalf of government. It took, it took us about a whole year to negotiate because we didn't have the funding. We had to borrow the funds from our Chinese uh, partners at about $2 billion to buy 10% uh, of the shares. Yeah, a similar situation also with Navaha. We came in, we got 7.5%. Uh, we also had to borrow money. Due to a lack of funds, Epangelo sells its shares in its EPLs in exchange for money. At the moment, it's a vacuum. We don't know if we have to continue on the commercial rules, but we have to give away our, 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 our shares in exchange for money or whether there was some legislation. So we are pushing for legislation to be put in place which will give the government an automatic uh, share in at least the strategic minerals so that we do not have to compete with people with money. We need to ensure that it is either legislated for a pangero to have an interest in all mining, just like all the petroleum agreements have a NAMCO interest representing state. It is not negotiable. It just does not work when the state, the Republic of Namibia, is subjected to buy interest in its own natural resources. It is unacceptable. It's very much painful to some of us who are presenting our communities out there that are going through poverty and we are sitting on the mineral. Namibia is one of the richest <coughs> countries, if not in the whole world, but we are always begging to be given food, to be given medicine. However, the chairperson of the Parliamentary Standing Committee emphasized that Epangelo Mining needs to raise funds through various stock exchange platforms that would enable the company to secure the necessary capital for its operations. How does the same companies that have got their asset in Namibia, that they are becoming multi-millionaires, get it on the same international market, but you cannot, unless you are not fit to be there, then give it to somebody else to do it. Subjected. Epangelo Mining has discovered a substantial gold deposit worth $70 billion in the Daures constituency. Once the mining operations are fully operational, the state-owned enterprise will hold a 20% ownership stake in this venture. Renate Rengura, NBC News, Swakopmund.